Republican primary for governor. Here are those results one more time. Bailey winning the nomination for the Republican Party. He will face off against Pritzker in the general election. Irvin already giving his concession speech tonight. WGN's Eric Rung is at the Darren Bailey headquarters in downstate Effingham. I'm sure there are a lot of happy people there tonight, Eric. Yeah, absolutely. They've been cheering pretty much all night long here. We just heard from Senator Darren Bailey here a short time ago, uh, really going after J.B. Pritzker, but also thanking all of the other candidates that ran against him here in this primary. A couple of things that really stood out in what he said is now is the time to unite and move forward. We believe in this movement together. We will get Illinois back on track. He says that will happen. The other thing that he really talked about was just the money aspect of this and just how much he was outspent. He said, we were outspent tens of millions of dollars, and this is how it's done. Our movement is growing. When they show up in November, uh, like they did tonight, talking about voters, we will win. And then he finished it off with by saying, here's a tip for J.B. Pritzker. Start packing, my friend. November 8th, you're fired. Of course, has been a big campaign slogan here for the Bailey campaign as they've gone through this primary here as I said, we just heard from Bailey a short time ago. Here is a little of what he had to say. Thanks be to God, we did it. Here's a tip and some advice for J.B. Pritzker. Start packing, friend. Because on November 8th, you're fired. Uh, of course, that was a, a big line. Got a huge, huge round of applause here at uh, where Bailey's campaign supporters have been watching the results come in. Now, we are told that Darren Bailey will be talking uh, to reporters here in, in just a few minutes uh, where he will actually be taking questions from reporters. Uh, we're going to try and move our stuff down there to make sure that we're able to bring that to you as well. But for now, we are live in Abingham. I'm Eric Rung, WGN News. Eric, before you go and, and move to go get interviews with Darren Bailey, I thought it quite interesting that he gave quite a big shout out to Chicago since he's been calling it a hellhole for so long. Yeah, that was another thing that I saw. Uh, he said, you know, Chicago, who in the house is from Chicago? And there was a lot of people that uh, did applaud that. Of course, during the WGN TV debate, he said it was a corrupt uh, hellhole. Um, also talked a lot about all of the crime that's been happening in Chicago. This may be one of those moments where we see Darren Bailey start to kind of move a little bit in such his hard right stance, at least in that area, because because he knows that he is going to have to get some votes in Cook County in Chicago if he has a chance at beating J.B. Pritzker. Oh, yeah. All right.